having sold over 13 million copies since launching in March, making nearly $400 million. Play Arankman's Battlegrounds is a bona fide blockbuster. Blue Hole Studios via SIDEARMS4 reason ya to be even more impressive is that the game technically isn't finished, it's available only through Steam, the world's largest digital game store, as an early access title. That means you can buy it and play it, as millions have, but it's not considered a finished product. At any given point in a day, hundreds of thousands of people are playing Battlegrounds. It's the number one must played game on the world's largest game service, Steam, with over 1 million concurrent players Valve that's a tremendously important metric. Steam is, by far, the largest game platform, with somewhere in the vicinity of 200 million active users. The top two spots are usually permanently occupied by Dota 2, which is free, and Counter-Strike Global Offensive, which costs $15 Battlegrounds costs $30. Both of those games are created and operated by Valve, the same company that runs Steam. The creative director for Battlegrounds, Brendan Playerunkman Green, celebrated a previous Steam achievement on Twitter as Green pointed out, Battlegrounds snagged the record for highest peak player count of any non-Valve game way back in July. Just a few months later, and the game is the highest peak player count of any game on the service. This is especially impressive as the game has only been available since March, and, of course, is unfinished, yet it bests the likes of Grand Theft Auto V and Fallout 4, and even Valve's own Heva hitters. There's a simple explanation for why it's doing so well it's an unbelievably good game. More than just a bizarre name, Player Unknown's Battlegrounds boasts a brilliant concept 100 people on a massive island, armed with their wits and a scattered arsenal, fighting to the death. Whoever survives at the end of the match wins, and there can only be one. In images, Battlegrounds looks like a shooting game. In reality, it's a game about survival. Shooting is just part of survival. Blue Hole Studios' The Future of Battlegrounds is even brighter. The game is expected to reach 1.0 by the end of the year, and it should arrive on this box one by then as well. All of which is to say one thing expect to hear a lot more about Battlegrounds as the year goes on.